So at this point, do yourself a favor and go get you a popcorn machine, ladies and gentlemen, because I know you constantly be running out of popcorn, right? Because we have a wild story indeed. Now, a couple of days ago, first of all, like the video if you think there are two genders. Dislike the video if you think there are only 5,000 genders. I want to know where you guys at with it. Now, a few days ago, or I should say a few weeks ago, get ready for the video, guys. You guys are not ready for what's about to hit you, okay? It's about to hit you hard. Harder than a BBC. And listen, I have a BBC as well as a, I'm a brown guy, okay? I have a BBC. But where my BBC homies at, though? Get your BBC or I, I scratch that part. What am I saying? Bruh. Now, a few weeks ago, we had a situation with Assassin's Creed. A lot of people were like, okay, so we're gonna have a Japanese protagonist. Guess what? We don't get that. A lot of people got mad. Then we had this edit warfare going on with Wikipedia where people are trying to edit past history absolute clownery i guess everybody would agree with this part right so some people are agreeing or basically editing on wikipedia the fact that he did not exist or the fact that he exists so from both sides everybody's like fighting everybody's fighting this and that and you know what after that massive beef uh, people were like you know what yeah enough of that bull squash man i was like be tired bro we sick and tired enough of this battle who are we fighting for man why are we fighting for that dumb stuff right like yeah who cares bro we're gonna have a bbc samurai he's gonna have a family it's gonna be beautiful it's gonna be wholesome it's a session screen man this is an ai image this is not real guys cameras did not exist back then okay a lot of people were like bro like bbc samurai with a family in japan oh hell yeah it's gonna be wholesome ubisoft comes out and they said that hey we turning yasuke gay oh shit they turned him gay. Uh, Noi, the, the female protagonist as well, the actual Japanese protagonist, they turned her gay as well. Oh, shit. Oh. Right after that, there was another volcano. Then, you know what? People started fighting, fighting, fighting. We beefing, we beefing, we beefing. Like, punch right there, uppercut right here, jab, jab, left, right, square, square, triangle, triangle, depending on what controller you're playing with, right? Like, that's how it is on PlayStation. Bruh. And then, fast forward to now. This is where we are. Roll it. Ubisoft had a big preview for their upcoming games this year, and... Two days ago, they put out this big 13-minute trailer going over the game. And naturally, they're getting minutes? eaten up in the comments. 44,000 downvotes in every single comment. Just about. I mean, there's there's a couple positive ones here and there. But yeah. the majority of the comments are roasting the game pretty badly. And this is all on mm. Ubisoft. But it's not just the trailer, ladies and gentlemen. There's a lot uh -oh. of things that are pretty bad about it that deserve the roasting. Okay, One, like what? taking the japanese inspired music and throwing hip hop kind of beats all over it no. that's kind of strange hey we got a <sighs> we got a black guy in here better make sure that we make all of the music hip hop no they and then did that the historical errors a lot of historical issues with this people are pointing out because it doesn't matter if you do a japanese game and get things wrong because remember the person who's writing and crafting the story for this game is a white woman if this were the case for any other culture there would be massive outrage by the game journals but this time the game gets a pass no need to worry uh -huh. about it when it comes to japanese culture that's not a big deal yeah. just shows you how hypocritical these people are and speaking uh, of if i if i don't uh, if i remember correctly they were uh, they made a massive fuss and uh, the journalists were complaining about ghost of tsushima like e -e 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 -e. why why do we have asians in e -e 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 in ghost of tsushima right like I, I remember like they were being really really racist towards that uh and ultimately you know ghost of tsushima is ghost of tsushima and it succeeded people loved it people loved it and it was it's a game set in japan with a japanese protagonist and yeah people loved it so culture the people that are really roasting this are the japanese themselves okay. over on the japanese trailer for the game those oh, comments no. are glorious and we're going to take a look at some of them thanks to grums who took this reddit post and some of these are glorious uh -oh. so let's take a look at some of these comments uh -oh. here I'm just going to start off with what Grums points out here in the post, which is kind of a summary of all of these comments. Uh, the battling to the rap music, walks through villages just beating up Asians, excessive non-honorable <laughs> violence. That's actually a really good point. Because as far He's as I understand, tank. He's like, a tank, crushing yeah. the head of someone that's already been defeated is not what the Japanese samurai would do. Uh, that's what that's what's funny about it. they're getting all kinds of things wrong and none of it matters. I guarantee you they did not bring in some kind of cultural expert or or something like that to help them make this game because Ubisoft, they don't care bro. they don't care about getting Japanese culture and history right but it's like I said before if it was any yeah. other culture 
they would all be going and, in. And, and listen, man, like all my black homies that are watching this video, this is nothing against like the color of someone's skin, right? It, it's nothing. I, I'm sure, I'm sure there is racism. I'm pretty sure all, some people are that, that are racist that are coming out right now and they're using this as an advantage. But generally speaking, people are for example right like uh, asian people are also considered a minority i'm a brown guy i'm also considered a minority uh, and, and of course i have faced racism in my life as well uh, everybody in a way has this is nothing to do with that okay people just simply want you know people wanted a japanese uh a japanese game set in or i mean assassin's creed game set in japan and they wanted to ultimately have a japanese protagonist yeah sure you got a chick as well but but people want like a samurai a japanese samurai a bbc samurai is way too strong it's a compliment though i also have a bbc but i cannot compete with a black bbc though come on now that that's a compliment though you know you feel what i'm saying that's a compliment now uh, yasuke is a complete tank a lot of people are also having fair takes and i think this is a fair take they could have had yasuke as in the game they could have kept him in the game as is right he could have been in the game alongside like a japanese protagonist as well and they could have also ultimately made a good ass story where they were telling the story or what was going on alongside they could have showed uh, what was happening with like a black samurai or retainer I uh, listen I was not there I don't know whether he was a retainer or a samurai uh, I'm not a history buff either I yeah I'm not a history buff okay but but they could have actually went that route some people are also saying keep him in a D DLC <laughs> okay I, I mean memes aside though okay they could have kept that too they could have done that as well but now nah, they are doing this for pandering a lot of you that realize uh, a lot of you a lot of you that are awake that's a new word back in the days woke was considered to be some something yeah back in the days the word woke was considered good right like it was good to be woke which meant that you were aware of the surroundings now i guess the word is awake and the word woke has been hijacked by all this crap and people just call it woke because of all the bull squash that's going down so it's easier to say that way because there are real terms to describe it and if you just if you use those terms oh you're gonna get banned bro you're gonna get banned so people just use one word to describe everything uh instead of like paragraphs and paragraphs so yeah that's uh, apparently okay but check this insane imagine if this game was based on some like african history over in africa or something and they got a bunch of stuff wrong there'd be a thousand articles from kotaku and the gamer uh, and, and yeah rightfully so rightfully so but this time of course uh since it's asia and it's japan they don't care alone talking about how awful and tragic this shit is it's true you know they would uh makes all villagers bow to him i don't know if they just do it or if he tells them to do it i didn't watch 13 minutes of that trailer uh i can't tell you if uh, he was a samurai play, class play. they would bow to him because they were kind of up above regular people. Uh, they would definitely notice him, though, and kind of look at him funny because everybody in Japan is Asian. At least in that time period, there was very rare there'd be a foreigner there. They kept their country borders shut. <laughs> yeah, this is crazy, right? Like, uh, he just destroyed <laughs> he destroyed all the Japanese. Imagine you're a Japanese man and you were like, or a chick, right? You're like, yay, I'm gonna uh, finally Assassin's Creed set in Japan, right? I'm, I'm gonna play as a guy that looks like me and I'm gonna go ahead and go crazy. You know, samurai, samurai this, samurai that, samurai this. Triangle, triangle, square, square, triangle, square, triangle, right? But you play with with a BBC samurai and you ultimately destroy your own people in the game, <laughs> right? It is crazy. And he, they, they made him look good as well. I, I have to agree The the trailer looked good. Okay, minus the woke crap uh, and the woke BS that's what happening as well, right? Minus all that, they made him a really good character in the game, right? He's buff. I love it. I love it. Ultimately, from playing a game, I want my character to be strong like that. But of course, people people are talking about the setting here right they want to ultimately have a japanese male protagonist because the game is set in japan right and especially you're talking about feudal japan oh hell yeah people wanted the history to be there the history to be preserved and, and the history to be uh, the history to be told right but they done none of that they decided to go that in the route of hip-hop i love hip-hop but but of course, like, if you're gonna use the Japanese music and turn that into hip-hop, <laughs> I didn't know about it. I'm just learning that right now based on this video. But yeah, holy crap, guys. Holy crap. Uh, and if you snuck in, they would take you out. They would end you just for being there. That's how they were. They were very isolated. And there was a point where, like, some their country borders shut. And if you snuck in, 
They would take you out. They would end you. Oh, damn. Just for being there. That's how they were. They were very isolated. And there was a point where, like, some Dutch in came in and stuff like that. There were a few people there. Uh, but it was not a common thing. It was a very, very, very rare thing. But let's take a look at some of these comments here. Uh-oh. So these apparently come off of the Japanese trailer to the game. And some of them are pretty good. So let's go. I like the ones back here the best. I find it interesting that Japanese people bow so much to Yusuke. I can ignore the historical falsification that Yusuke was a samurai, but this is... Uh, is it Yusuke or Yasuke? I always call him, call him Yasuke, though. Uh, Yusuke, one in the comments if, you, if it's Yusuke, two in the comments if it's Yasuke. I think it's Yasuke, okay. Uh. This isn't Japan to begin with. It's Japan made by foreigners. That's not it. Ubisoft, the graphics are good, that's all. I'll buy it. The graphics aren't even that good, bro. What the hell? The graphics are pretty mid. Uh, they're not bad, they're not trash. They're not the best. I wouldn't even say good. I would say they're all right. They're all right. Maybe when you play the game by yourself, they're gonna look good. But in this video, they don't, I mean, they're all right. They're not good, but they're all right. They're mid, they're mid. If you are able to respect Japan a little more. I didn't even travel to France, but I experienced discrimination. Why <laughs> would I buy such a middle finger to Japan? Aside from the fictional setting of Black Samurai, there is no need to portray Japanese people as shabby and make them bow repeatedly every time they pass by. It almost feels like there is malice towards Japanese people. Personally, I've never understood the concept of cultural appropriation. Now I've come to fully appreciate how vicious and unpleasant it is. It is a well-known historical fact that Yusuke later traveled to Europe, killed French people, and became Napoleon. This person talks about commenting on an English version of the trailer. When I commented, where is the samurai in the English version, I was met with a barrage of criticism. Overseas is scary. So that's where we're at. I've, I've, I've talked about this before. They're not very happy with the game over there. I think this game is still going to sell, at least in the West. And yeah. you know, it, it is what it is. Whether or not this is a good game yeah. or not, I don't yeah, know. Yeah, controversy sells. Controversy, um, yeah, controversy is definitely going to help boost its sale. Absolutely. To what degree? I guess we got to find out. No. But stop lying and saying that this is a historically accurate game because it's not. It's not. Uh, you can tell yeah. that they didn't really get anybody in here to go over the history and the culture. I mean, you actually have Games Radar pointing that out, at least on this part. Oh, well, they got some of the architecture wrong. And talk about that. But like I said, if this was any other culture, they would be pissed and they would be all over it. But because it's Japan, for some reason, they're allowed to ignore it and turn it into it's not that big of a deal. When it seems to be, it seems to me that the people that this game is trying to represent aren't very happy about it. And if it was anybody else, it would be a problem to these hypocrites, but not when it comes to Japanese people. Mm -hmm. Why don't they like Asian people? That's what I want to ask games journalists. It seems like Guys, check out this video on the screen because recently Nick Merckx apparently went crazy. And uh, he is, uh, yeah, there's like a massive beef going down as well. He's getting canceled left and right. People are trying to dox him, send him heaven proposals based on a true story. Check this video out. If you've already seen it, then you can check out the video on the left.